if you're married or in a serious relationship hold on this is very important for you don't go anywhere just watch till the very end see do you know one of the most painful things that can ever happen to anybody is being with if you're married or in a serious if you're married or in a serious relationship hold on this is very important for you don't go anywhere just watch till the very end see do you know one of the most painful things that can ever happen to anybody is being with someone that doesn't want to be with you anymore being with someone that doesn't love you anymore but they are just there with you because what will people say so, we already have children let me just stay you know uh, in my family we don't divorce uh, we don't date for 15 years. We go soon marry. Maybe just day. If I leave, I'm now. Where I won't come go. You know, so there are reasons why they are with you. But they, their heart is no more with you. They are physically present with you. But emotionally, they left a long time ago. This is what is happening in a lot of relationships. This is what's happening in a lot of marriages. Many people do not love their spouse anymore. Could be because of one or two bad habits. You know things that have lingered on that have sometimes financial breakdown a lot of things cause people to begin to you know change their minds about their spouse but trust me it has to do it would majorly have to do with this spouse in particular so how do you know when your partner does not love you anymore how do you know first of all there's going to be a breakdown in communication and I say breakdown in communication means that this person that used to always talk every time, you know, when someone loves you, especially a woman, ah, when a woman loves you, mm, I know men, are, they can easily wave things off. Like if you do something they don't like, they can afford to, to overlook it. But they love you, but it's not every time they want to talk. They don't have strength sometimes. They just look and like, uh, overlook it. But I see a woman, when a woman loves you, mm, she will talk about every little wrong you do when you do something that pains her she will want to let you know she will want to complain she will want to talk if you act some type of way she'll complain you know if you're cheating if you are just generally if you just have one bad habit that is not sitting well with her she will tell you and she will tell you you do it a hundred times she will tell you a hundred times that is what a woman does when she loves you but when the love is dying or is dead she will not say anything anymore so that's why i say breakdown in communication because not just on the woman part also on the men part it, it takes love to want to sit down to complain about something you know so when there is that breakdown this person that is always telling you oh i don't like this thing you're doing now it's quiet you would do these things if you like come and dance in front of their eyes they will just look at you they are emotionally mentally tired they are tired so first of all if you did not know here is one sign to look out for now secondly this first one now leads to the second one which is not dealing with issues so usually when you do wrong she be they will complain people will now look for ways to deal sort it out I don't like this i don't like this no 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 let's sort it out i don't like this one let's so when they don't communicate with you they don't give you an avenue to change whatever bad thing you're doing so you will just keep on enjoying your life misbehaving thinking that you're you know you you're there but they are done they're just watching you and then now afterwards this particular one now leads down to lack of intimacy and remember that intimacy is not just about sex you know what i mean it's not just about lashing intimacy can also be those times when you guys just hug yourselves and be gisting you know about your day gossip about one or two things that happen at work laugh at those people you know you know some women always have this women always love to tell men about this funny guys that are trying to hide them you know so you will make mockery of them together all those things builds towards intimacy too intimacy is not where you are but you know there are little little things you're working in the kitchen and they come 
touch your you know smack you at the behind you know you know all those kind of things now those mushy mushy ah when you go out you think of your partner you want to send him a text message like ah i miss you i'm at work shy it's hectic i just thought of you and smile because yeah you make my day easy these things are the things that are intimacy do you understand all all inclusive you begin to lose that you will see that you will just stay <laughs> your partner does not call if they don't call if you don't it's, it's now strictly business or should i say uh, what's the word to use ah you know it must be if if you're seeing your partner's call know that there's a problem at home or the kids or this one but it must be something that is serious it doesn't have to do with the little things mushy mushy sweet sweet you know so you think about it me i'm trying to talk up to you when last did that partner of yours say ah uh, i just called to even if you guys woke up on the same bed oh, i just called to check on you i missed you I, I i can't wait to see you in the evening what should i bring back for you when i'm coming or you as a woman you go to the market it's not how you go to market you don't want to buy one or two things for your boo now you know how we are we are very ah we you know how we behave so you just go your woman will go to market come back nothing for you only the children 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 so this morning i'm just trying to remind you look look at your relationship look at your marriage is is, uh, is there a breakdown is something not going well see the best thing to do now mm? have a quiet time with your partner you guys must you don't stay in that house where people have always stayed all day a year uh, uh, be innovative for once take her out or take him out when last did you guys even have a time out when last every time monotonous you go to work he goes to work you come back the two of you you check out the children pick children from school you prepare food you sleep at night uh, but it doesn't go well you know so what i would want you to do as you have heard what i'm saying and you feel like you've noticed one or two of these points happening to you happening to your relationship <clears throat> call your partner fix a date it must not be anywhere just where your hand reach no matter how small the place is no matter how luxurious if you can do luxury good for you if you can do you know low-key stuff anyhow it, it might not even be a date you can just decide to say oh yeah this evening when you come back um rest a little before i come back from work you will wear your shoe i want us to take a stroll let us walk a little so you can take a long walk and you talk walk or you sit down in a big place to have your dinner just find a nice spot quiet if you're walking you walk but you talk ask questions investigate you know talk and when you're doing this you're talking and all no judgment zone no argument no claiming rights listen listen with the sole purpose of trying to make sure that you build rebuild repair so here there is no time to blame no time to this allow your partner to express themselves and when they are done the first thing you should do is apologize for not even noticing first for not noticing is the crime he did so apologize and when you're done with that you begin to state your own whatever it is that you you feel like you notice too then you now say what can we do to make this better if you guys cannot do it alone that's where you need professional help you can seek for a counselor or something but take the step try you know try trust me there is no perfect relationship every anywhere anywhere the one that works is the one that the both parties put in the work put in the work so you have to wake up wake up if this made sense to you and you feel like this is i want you to share comments give me your own opinions too